Hello everyone, in this tutorial we will show you how the store feature works. Let's start with placing an order. Open the store app on your device. Go to the store option. If you want to sort products, tap open. If you want to sort products, tap on the drop down menu and select your desired option. Tap the products to order and know more details about them. Enter the quantity and select your desired color. Tap review icon to check user reviews. You can tap the share icon to share the product with others. Tap the plus icon to add your product to your cart. Click on the shopping cart icon in the right upper hand corner if you are ready to check out. Here you can check the payment details and apply the coupon if you have one. Enter the coupon code if you have one. Tap the plus or minus icon to increase or decrease the quantity of the product. Tap checkout to continue. Now you are going to need to provide your billing address. Enter your name, email, phone number, address, city, state, zip code, and country. Tap update billing information when you are finished. If your shipping address is different from your billing address, tick mark this box and enter in all the information. If it is the same, leave the check box as it is. If you have any additional instructions, add them here. Tap Pay Now to continue. Select the type of payment you wish to use and click Confirm. If you want to use the eWallet Pay feature, you will need to first add money to your wallet. To add money, go back to the home page of your app and select the eWallet Payment feature. Tap Add Money. Enter or select the amount of money and tap Add Money. Tap Proceed Securely to continue. Here we have the PayPal payment gateway for adding money to the wallet. Enter your PayPal credentials to log in. Tap Pay Now to continue. You will see a confirmation message. Once the money is added, go back to the cart section in the store. Tap check out, then pay now. Now select the e-wallet payment method and tap place order to continue. You will see a confirmation message. If you want to continue shopping, tap here. Tap on the hamburger icon to open the profile menu. Under my orders, you can check all your orders and their details. Once the order is placed, the store owners need to go to the web dashboard. For that, they need to log in into their account and then go to the dashboard. Go to My Apps, click on View More, and go to the store. Once you are on your store dashboard, go to Manage Orders. Here you will see all your orders. Click on the eye icon to the right. A pop-up with order details will appear. Click on Process Order. Once the store owner clicks on Process Order, the order status of the app will change to Processing. When the order is ready to ship, click on the Ship button. You can even print the invoice from here. Now select the carrier you desire. Enter in the order title, tracking number, and tracking URL. Click Submit when you are finished. Once the order is successfully completed, the order status on the app will change to complete. That is all for today. Thank you for watching.